Hello world, I'm Braincliff, and uh, I, I wanted to do a video for 6k, and here I am. This is gonna have a lot of news about uh, just future channel stuff, and uh, I'm gonna be complaining about Ainz a lot, and uh, I'm in the audience room with tons and tons of people listening in on this, like, more people that, that more people than the people that were there for the Elrian talk, which, uh, assuming everything goes right, should have been the video that went up yesterday. Uh, if not, whoops. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I might get interrupted by, uh, just, the, like, the random DMs going on, but that's gonna be how it is. I don't have Venna here with me to, uh, read all of them, so here I am. Uh, looking at the video duration, you might just be like, oh boy, but y yep, it's gonna be one of those videos. Let's see, alright, Acrius says, uh, boobs are both the greatest and worst things that have ever existed. <laughs> uh... Someone says yesterday more like one week delay kick. Yeah, okay. Uh, Elrian talk has been uh, it, it, I, I yeah, it's been hell to record, but it's done so it should be up yesterday <laughs> But but you know y YouTube is dumb sometimes. Oh my goodness. Uh, just a reminder. Ayn is gay from Spirua. Aiden says boobs break backs uh, Acrea says, I'm, I don't low-key volunteered, but I don't think I'm ready for all the PMs. <laughs> uh, Wouter's typing a thing. Oh boy, I'm, I am not going to get to any of the things that I wanted to see. <laughs> I should just make videos that are just nothing but hanging in the audience room. This, this is such a great idea. I wish more, uh, uh YouTuber discords had the idea of having an audience room, like, thing. But, like, like, I'm intending to talk about certain things here, but, you know, I, I have no idea how long it's gonna take for me to get to any of them. Although the cool thing is they're so distracting that maybe you can ignore that I have no idea what I'm playing with this character. Uh, Wouter says, only I, the master of breasts, can identify a bosom from another. Uh, yeah, okay, so before I started recording, uh, someone said something about boobs, and I, I complained, like, if you're looking at a bunch of racks that come from Elsword, can you, like, look at them and be like, oh yeah, th those boobs come from Rose specific- no, they're boobs, they're all the same. I, I don't see why anyone needs to prefer like, oh, well, Vara's boobs are better than Elysis's boobs or something like that. Uh, then again, I say that uh, Aisha's legs are better than all the other legs, so I, I don't know, maybe I'm a hypocrite. Okay, so before we go any further off topic, uh, I, I want to talk about 6k, th oh wait, jeez. Uh, people may think uh, large breasts look nice, but when the bra comes off, it's hell. Also, they're all the same. Look at Aura compared to Aisha. Do you mean on the legs or the boobs? No, because, like, the legs in this game, they come in all kinds of sizes. Like, for some reason, Eve has really long legs, and, like, Elysis has really thick legs. Oh boy, okay. Uh, Aiden says, feet all look the same. Well, feet all look gross. Uh, let's see, Acrius says, uh, bars boobs. <laughs> okay, uh, complaining about Ainz, no, wait, no, that's the thing I want to talk about a lot. No, you know what, I'm gonna start with complaining about Ainz first. I'm, I'm on my, uh, I'm on my boneless blue hen, because, you know, I only got him to a uh, first job, and then I just stopped playing him. You might be wondering why I'm on this character since I'm never gonna actually use him. I ran out of characters to use Philosopher's Scrolls on, and this event gives you 19 of them. And I usually don't use Philosopher's Scrolls until I reach level 90 because that's the part of the experience table that has not been revamped, so it's a huge spike in leveling time, which means that I'm actually gonna have to level up two characters to 90. And the crappy thing about that is, uh, I'm, I'm out of character slots. My only options were Grandma Lou, our abortion, and this, so I decided, mm, you know what, I think I'll go with this first. Oh boy, okay, Wouter says, as a Night Emperor man, I can say Elysis is thick as shit. Well, I mean, as a Night Emperor, I guess you get to be around Elysis more often. Uh, alright, let's see, Aiden says, incest? Incest, incest, it's the best, put your sister to the test. Acrius says, yo, I always wondered why they're called Philosopher's Scrolls. Like, is there a really inspirational quote that makes her care <laughs> Oh my god, that's so true! <laughs> Spiro says, Shakti's legs are longer than her torso. This is also unfortunately true. Oh my god, I have like four people typing to me at any given time. Yoko no Koronomo says, A bloody queen's chest looks like it grew massive from Crimson Avenger. Did it happen because she drank all the blood? I really hope she didn't drink any blood, because all the blood combat she does is probably really good at transferring diseases. Like, what if she uses blood fall on a glitter and then suddenly she has AIDS? Let's see, Jiggle Physics says, So would you prefer Grandma Lou boobs or Aura boobs? 
I don't, I don't know their boobs. They're all the same. Well, I mean, I guess with Grandma Lou, like, since her skin is like half white, half blue, I guess they would look different. <laughs> Let's see. Wowder says, "Skudu, skade, Elisis Onechan." It went in all the. Oh my God! Let's see. Sprua says the Lyme disease. <laughs> Anyways, um. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to level up this Ayn, and then I'm gonna have to make another character and get him to 90 or her, and then I, I've got one more character slot, which I might use, I'm not sure. I like having an empty character slot open because it gives me, um, it lets me check usernames that may or may not be registered. Now, I might be on this Ayn, and I might be leveling him up right now, but I've got so many complaints already. And, uh, I gotta say, you know, I know the whole tactical trooper guide when joke has kind of run its course. But I think I'm gonna have to do that after all. Uh, no guarantees, but uh, when I logged onto this island, I just took a look at all the skills and I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? And uh, yeah, I don't get it. Someone told me, oh, Blue Hen, it's just it's just Code Battle Seraph with feelings. And uh, I, I, I get the joke, but uh, no, it's a lot more complicated than that. <gasps> oh, geez. So you know what? Maybe I'll get to the Chung Guide after all. No guarantee. It's just I, I now see the importance for it. Like, I don't know if anybody's ever looked at Chung like as confused as I looked at this Ayn. But um, y you know what? Uh, just in case they have, who knows? I do really want to go really hard on the channel, because um, it's summer, and I have bigger channel growth in the summer, it seems. Uh, which makes sense, because, you know, people have more time to uh, level grind, so naturally. But, uh, yeah, I, I want to push a lot of things. Now, I'm going to sound like a politician and make a bunch of promises, and then none of them end up actually coming up. Uh, but some of the things that you can expect in the future, uh, some videos about the new patch specifically, some mount reviews, uh, character guides after all, and maybe some new series is. I want to do more Elrian talks. I want to do some uh, more gameplay videos because, like, I, 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 I'm not going to be like delete and uh, run the same dungeon with 20 different characters and just upload all of them because, God, have some fucking restraint. But, um, I was thinking some more like achievement e videos, kinds of like, how high can I do, uh, Elrian Ode City? What is the best that I can get on all of my characters? Things like that. Um, you know, maybe some challenge headers when I do get lazy. Although, I'm sure that some people still like seeing the challenge headers videos anyway. Uh, I, I like the one that I did with uh, Rose. Because, you know, I'm sure that there's some people wondering, Oh, well, what's Brandcliff's gameplay like when he's not on a super powerful, like, plus 11 daddy perk as his cannon? So, yeah, I think I might have some more of those, but with alts. Um, yeah, I, I, I might have a bigger alt presence on my channel. So yeah, so those are some of the things that you can expect to see in the future. Now let's 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 uh, let's uh, be disappointed in some DMs. Uh, Yoko no Konomo says Blue Hen is actually Red Hen. Akri is <laughs> Akri is still talking about the Philosopher Scrolls. Read the Philosopher Scroll. To be or not to be, that is the question. Yo, that's so fucking deep. Hold on, my whole life perspective has changed. Your levels increased, but w what kind of quote on the Philosopher Scroll? puts a 30 second uh, cooldown on your character. Now that's the real question. Let's see, Wouter says, Ein is an Absluss, one of the three paths Jehovah's Witnesses. Can I get a McMuffin at 5 p.m.? It's just a phase, mom. Wait, don't you mean it's not just a phase? Ah, oh, whatever. Oh, geez. Nako Lu says, I don't know if I should DM you. Mm, no, no, no. Uh, you know what, give me a second. I need to send a very disappointed picture to that person. I'm not gonna say what they said, but I'm gonna be disappointed in them anyway. There we go. Sprua says, if you're gonna teach them how to TT, don't make them stack flex. Stacking flex is great. Also, skill stack is, uh, dead. So, I, I guess it doesn't even matter anymore anyway. Let's see, Iden says, Philosopher Machine Broke. Acria says, didn't they take the cooldown away? Uh, did they? I haven't used Philosopher Scrolls in a while. The last time I used them, I think it was, maybe it was a part of the new Quality of Life patch. I just haven't used any Philosopher Scrolls since, because I haven't had any. Shouldn't you play with me? Stacking doesn't affect your power rank, which is dumb. Uh, that person who's disappointed gave me an XD. Okay, uh, future things about live streams. I'm definitely gonna have more of those as well. In fact, I'm actually going to have a live stream this week, and it's one that I think you should be excited for if you even remotely kind of like this channel. Because, um, this Saturday, they are having a double drop and double experience day. And, um, hmm. Well, unfortunately, I know one dungeon that benefits both from double drop and double experience. 
Hollowell, and uh, oh jeez, I am going to try to have a Hall of L marathon live stream. So it'll be this Saturday, it'll start at 12 like any other of one of my live streams, and uh, we're just gonna try to do as much Hall of L as I can put up with for one day, and then fucking stop, and then hopefully not run another Hall of L for like a year. You know, some people still ask me why I do this to myself, and I gotta say, uh, while I do oh still God. firmly believe my Chung deserves the best, and even though it escapes me, I still want to go for it. Um, at first, well, drop my mic. Uh, at first, I said, well, you know, like these uh, resonance points that I've been getting, they're not really a very good consolation prize. But I think I changed my mind. They are a good consolation prize. I have 176 resonance. I want to get up to 200. I'm gonna be like Quasar, but without paying as much. It's gonna be great, and, uh, well, no, not the live stream. the live stream is not gonna be great. I also had another big idea for a live stream, and, uh, I'm not gonna say what it is on this video, but, uh, it's gonna be disgusting. Shout out to all the people in the audience room who, uh, showed up to here, cause, um, yeah, it'll be really something, and, uh, if for some reason you still don't know, the audience room is a feature on Brand Clip Siege Posting, my Discord server, that allows you to hear me record videos before they go up. And uh, you, you can DM certain key individuals while the recording is going on to comment on the video as it's going on. Um, oh jeez, these DMs need to slow down though, I can't hear all of them. Let's see, Aiden says, I woke up to this shit! <laughs> Let's see, Wouter says, uh, Wouter says he's gonna do Hall of L2 and he wants to see who gets it first. Uh, drop rate effects. Uh, drop rate does um, affect things in Hall of L, so that, that's a thing you can try doing. Let's see. Uh, is it possible for you to make a channel specifically for tips and tricks? I don't want to make separate channels. Uh, I'd probably have it be a separate playlist. Um, but yeah, I, I would like to make more videos about that kind of thing as well. If you have suggestions for them, let me know, because um, I can't think of any specific tips or tricks I make videos on, but if you have ideas for them, go ahead. I am always open to video ideas, so um, if you guys have an idea for it, then you can always DM my alternate Discord account, Lolly of Wind, or you can leave a comment on any uh, Elsword YouTube video. Let's see. Jiggle Physics says, uh, Hall of L, uh, jokes. Kaiser Crow says, in response to Philosopher Scrolls, you stack them up to five in one go, so you could use up to five at once? Is that how it works? Oh boy. XX Break Cliff XX Tutorials! <laughs> Thanks for the channel idea, Wouter. I'll make sure not to use it. Okay, um. So, so more Ein complaints. I gotta say, um. The, the skill here, Abgrund, or no, Angriff, it's just Boneless Explosion. Actually, no, I got that backwards, because Boneless er, Explosion is actually Boneless Abgrund. But I gotta say, a why am I saying Abgrund? Angriff, whatever. But my, here's my question, right? These skills are so similar, but Explosion is a level 1 skill, and Angriff is a level 15 skill. I gotta say, when the Ideas team was coming up with this, how did they drop the ball so quickly that they reused the exact same idea all within the first 15 levels of a character? And, um, combos, right? This this stupid- I, 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 I'm gonna start doing top 10s on my channel when I get to it, uh, but- Here's one that I definitely want to do. Top 10 worst combos in this game. What's up with this, like, jump XZ combo? This is worthless. When are you ever going to actually use this? Heck, half the time you can only hit with one of them anyway. I, I, I don't know. And uh, this dash ZX combo. Why is it that both Richter get a dash ZX combo, but the Richter one sucks and the blue head one is cool? Look, with the Richter one, it, it it launches until you get to third job, but with the blue head one, it just pushes enemies back, which is how it should have been to begin with. And uh, when you finally get third job and you become a Richter, instead of getting two new combos, it's just that that dash ZX combo uh, doesn't uh, launch. And that's one of the two, quote, new unquote combos that you get, and uh, that's dumb. Why'd they not, you know, come up with something cooler? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter anyway, because when I play Richter, I just throw the spears. But, uh, yeah, shit's dumb. Uh, mount guides, that's the thing I also said I wanted to do. Um, I, I can only review the mounts I do have, and there are some mounts that I don't have. I gotta make a list of the mounts I do and don't have. Uh, for those of you guys who are on Brand Club Siege posting or follow my social media platforms, I made a mount tier list. Uh, future me put it on screen right now. And um, that's a list of the mounts I do have. I, I, 
normally I'd say something along the lines of, if there's a mount on here you want me to review, you can send it to me and then I'll make a video about it, but uh, mounts are $24? I don't know anyone who wants to pay $24 for me to make a video on something. <laughs> Speaking of paying, um, I, I, I don't want to mention this too much, but you know, I don't think I've like said it on enough different sources because you know, uh, people who watch my Elsword stuff, not all of them are going to watch all of my Elsword stuff, so you know, it varies. Uh, I'm live on Patreon now. I post things um, like future video previews. You can see the list of what videos I'm working on at any given time. You'll get shout outs in the videos, and it should make a noise and it should have a randomly generated uh, patron's username on it. So that's a thing. And, uh, I'm gonna do a, like, a non-obnoxious shout-out thing. Uh, future me, put it on screen right now. Um, you know, various other benefits, uh, sneak previews and things like that. Um, I think Varg Skeletor said it best. Uh, never required, always appreciated. I don't want to push it too much or, like, talk about it non-stop all the time. It's just, uh, I, I want to make sure everyone's aware it exists. And I don't want to pressure people into using it. I know how to, uh, promote Patreon without being a dickhead about it. Um, especially, like, I feel like the worst thing that people do with this, these things is, like, they put the Patreon announcement at the beginning of the video. It's like, what if that's the first video I've seen of you? And the first thing I hear is, oh, by the way, give me your money. It's like, no, don't do that. That's why I put the Patreon things, like, at the end of the video, which everyone else should do. I feel like they should be common sense, but no, some YouTubers are just money-grubbing. And uh, you'll always be able to enjoy the channel the same, with or without paying into it. It's just I want to give the option to people for if, you know, that's something they want to do. And, you know, I'd eventually like to get to the point where I can quit having crappy minimum wage jobs and just live on YouTube all the time. Uh, it, it, it's a very big dream, but, you know, you know maybe, maybe it'll be possible. I don't know until I try, right? So, yeah, okay, but enough about the Patreon thing. I don't want to talk about it too much. Uh, the real training curve of mine is pronouncing his skills, except you, except if you live in Wouterland. <laughs> Richter, Richter, no, it's Rig, Rigter. Uh, Wouter says it's pronounced Rigter, like with a G. Uh, yeah, see, uh, that's a video I can make. Elsword pronunciations, which is fucking dumb, because like, y you know, people say Luciel, right? But Luciella pronounces CL seal. You know, like the animal that when they're a baby, you get like a bunch of people from Canada beating them over the head with clubs. Yeah, yeah, apparently it's pronounced seal, and we're just supposed to all start saying that, like, no! Even, the, even, even though it's coming from the Demon Queen herself, it's still wrong. So, I, I don't I don't know. Uh, future video ideas, I guess. Let's see, Aiden says, uh, Names I'm never going to remember, they're used for Al Aldine stacks. Cucked Canada. Acrea says, it... Oh, I wanted to draw Abgrund, wrong seal. Ab oh, okay, so apparently I was calling... Uh, Apparently, I kept calling Angriff Abgrund because that's a Hersher skill, a character that I'm never gonna make. Uh, not just because of character slot limitations, although right now you can only have a maximum of 26 character slots, but there's 37 classes you might want to make. Like, man, that sucks. Let's see, uh, Biscuit Might says, Is there anything you are planning to get once the next stage of the Elsword Amazon shop comes back? Now, GM Rush has told me that apparently the week that this video is going up, is supposed to be the week that the Elsword Amazon shop comes back. And you know how they said with the last wave they wanted to, uh, quote, test it, unquote, and then they sold, like, one and a third of an umbrella? Yeah, apparently the umbrella's not coming back. Apparently most things aren't coming back. If that was just a test, why is that the only time that you were able to get certain key merchandise? That's dumb. Like, if they mess up the Elsword Amazon merchandise shop again, I am going to slam them with the, like, the meanest video I could ever possibly make. Except that video I made about Void Elsword. I think that was the meanest video I've ever actually made. Uh, which is great, because they deserve it. And, you know, it's funny, there was someone who commented like, Oh, but Brancliff, that's that's not the whole story, and you know, Void Elsword has good things about it too. And I'm like, but the point of that video wasn't to tell the whole story. The point of the video was to make fun of them for messing up. Let's see, Spiru says, Ein's jump X combo is trash in general regardless of class. Let's see, Wouter says, uh, can we buy a Lou Fist sex toy? Hmm, you, you go on ahead. I, th I think I'll pass on that. Aiden says, I play Void, but the community is shit. I play for the easy level. Uh, no matter how disgusting I think Void is, it, it's always good for testing a character that you're not sure you want to make, but you want to try them out. Especially because considering on the North American server, for some reason, account sharing of any form is a bannable offense. So you're supposed to really stick with just your own account. Although they don't have any limitations about letting you have multiple accounts. 
which is why sometimes you see people on the forums being like, I'm gonna sell an I username with every single skill name. So if you want to have this username, you have to pay me 500 mil first. Let's see, Acrius says, you pronounce it the exact way you said earlier. Angriff, ang Angriff, uh, Adrun. <laughs> These skill names are dumb. Uh, let's see. Jiggle Physics says, oh, thanks for letting us know that. So, uh, oh, wait, no, it said that already. Uh... A a Abgrund Afgrund? Water says Abgrund is pronounced a Af Afgrund? No, I was talking about the CL, not the heck. <laughs> I don't know. Wu says it's pronounced Seal. I'm not going to start saying that. Even it if it comes from Miss Demon Queen's mouth, uh, it's still wrong. I have a mount cube. I should probably use that. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna get a rickshaw for you. Yeah, we're gonna start using that. Right. Anyways, I am level 31. I could probably go on over to Altera now. I may as well live stream this, because this recording is going to take me forever. I've already been recording for 20 minutes. Oh, jeez. Nekalu says, oh, if human bodies are 70% water, then Rose is 70% helium. I mean, like, what are those? Aren't you supposed to say, what are those for shoes? Af, af run does fuck. Wow. You don't want to see my memes. Wouter says I don't want to see his memes right now. He's probably right. Um, so, yeah, uh, I don't, I don't have a, <laughs> the joke went over your head, says Acria, I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry, uh, since I can't see all six, like, people messaging me at once, uh, the timing element of these DMs is gone, so, yeah, water, water those, oh, oh, that's the joke, god damn it, <sighs> okay, um, well, I think I've somehow bubbled my way through everything else I wanted to say that isn't going to get a video of its own. But, uh, yeah, look out for the marathon live stream. It's gonna suck a big, fat destroyer. Uh, hope hopefully my, uh, all the leveling is done by then. Hopefully I've got all the stamina potions and hopefully I'm mentally prepared. Actually, the whole mentally prepared part, that's probably not happening, but, you know. Lots of videos to come in the future. Uh, I'm so weird. Oh yeah, there was gonna there was gonna be a video series that I was gonna make, and it, it's gonna be a lot of work. But um, like okay, uh, y'all know I I did the R videos, right? I kind of want to do videos on what I think of just everyone, not just the R videos. Um, no no plans on I hate R Hog Deluxe yet. You know, maybe maybe someday, but uh, I I think I'd want to do it for like some kind of crazy giant milestone. Maybe when I hit 10k. And I have as many subs as Vawful, that's probably not happening. Uh, being a variety elsewhere content creator will never allow me to hit it as big as someone who does PvP videos. Although, funny thing about Vawful, people like to make a lot of comparisons between Vawful and I, but I think what they don't realize is that Vawful and I don't really talk. <laughs> like, do, do people think we're like friends or rivals or something? No, we, do, we, just, we just acknowledge that each other exist, I guess. Like... I don't think I've ever even really played with him, except for this one time that I was in uh, his raid with Quasar on my Optimus. Uh, as you can probably imagine, I got a D-Rank because the boss died too fast. Whoops. Although it was funny, uh, Ivafel commented on my Elsor tournament video and he said, Wow, look at all these dislikes you get for telling the truth. So you know what, maybe he's a good guy after all. Maybe I should stop, like, uh, talking about him specifically when I make Eve jokes. Um, if I do get around to making that series about just what I think of everyone, um, I don't think I'd make a- I'd want to make an Eve video soon, but I think the first one would be either, uh, Reyna or Elisys or Rose. I want to do a video about how Rose did nothing wrong, cause it-, it I, oh god, uh, it, it's funny, someone made a comment on the Aura videos and they were like, Oh wow, uh, normal people love Aura and hate Rose, Brancliff likes Rose and hates Aura. Something like that. Although actually... No, no, you know what, I think I'm gonna save that for a while. I, I just had a really, like, shocking thing that I could say about the Rose video if I get around to doing it. But I think I'll wait until I get to the video, because uh, it's gonna blow people's minds and probably make people very angry at me. But then again, doesn't everything I do make people angry at me? Especially every time I mention Aisha's at all, because Aisha made to hate my videos. I, I don't know why, it's weird and it's sad, because I, I love Aisha, but they all hate my videos. Like, the only Aisha maids that'll actually watch me are Magic Spice and, um, Ideal Shoujo. Oh boy, people are gonna re Fears for my Luciel and Roses. Oh, no, I- No, if I were to make a video on Luciel, I'd probably just say something like, Why, why are Luciel mains so similar? Like, they all- they're all nice, 
uh, they're all into every aspect of the game and not just PvP. They're they're all like friends. They all ship Lu and CL together, which is weird. But you know, the Elria talk for that should be out by now. Um, you know what? I'm gonna say it again. <laughs> okay, it, for those of you guys who missed uh, it and haven't seen, right? Like for those of you who weren't in the audience room for it and you didn't see, uh, you didn't see it, which should have gone up yesterday. Uh, friggin' if you go on Wiki, right, and you look at the picture they used for base Lu and CL, the one where, like, Lu is standing up holding her, her claw, and CL is, like, standing backwards holding his guns, right? In that picture, and that is official art, by the way, they drew Lu half as tall as CL. Now, in reality, Lu is, like, up to CL's, like, chest, but in that picture, Lu's so short she can't even, like, suck his dick. What's up with that? It's, it's, it's weird, and it's part of the reason why I can't get around to, like, shipping them nowadays. I don't know, but that video should have gone up yesterday, and, you know, I've said that, like, 20 times by now, so... Yeah, that, 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 that's... That, yeah, alright, all right, let's move on. Is what I'd say if I had more things to talk about. But, no, that, that was all the things I said I wanted to talk about. Uh, alright, I'm, go I'm gonna open the floor to the, the DMs one last time. I'll respond to everything that they've said now, and then everything that they're about to say, and then I'll cut, a, cut off the video. Uh, guys, is there anything else you want me to talk about while we're all here? Let's see, Brancliffe, what if you wanted to go to PvP, but are against a Night Emperor who got plus 12% Mega Slash damage and 4 times tenacity skill damage? Um, you know, I guess I'd be afraid of his Mega Slash then, maybe? I actually, um, I, I, I did this really stupid thing with my guildies. I, I've got a friend who also mains Night Emperor. Uh, well, actually, no, he, he changed to Rune Master now. And, uh, we had this really uh, dumb idea. Let's PvP, but let's only equip one skill, and it's a really bad skill. So, he put on Mega Slash, right? And we started fighting for a while, and, like, I realized something. His Mega Slash actually kind of hurt. Uh, it, it still always knocked down, though. But, you, you know, it was, it was, it was, it really changed my perspective on some things. You know, a while ago, uh, Wilder had this really good thing, and I wish I saved it. He said, Force mod idea, Mega Slash inflicts depression. And if depression was the same debuff as the one you get from aging, Mega Slash would actually be kind of useful. Uh, so, you, you know, it's a joke. But I feel like the uh, I feel like the balancing team uh, should listen to it. And when I say balancing team, what I mean is um, a a baby monkey and a potted plant. Let's see. Nako Lu says, "Oh, oh, oh, oh those, those those are jokes about ours. Those are jokes about booms." Let's see. Spirua says, or no, uh, Yokoto says, "Can you talk about Elsort's economics?" Oh, that's a video idea I could make. Uh, we'll see. Stick around. Spruo says, Lollycons, the smaller the better. Ooh, ooh, boy. Let's see, Biscuit Might says, oh, oh, that's the picture of the gender Ben Luciel. Let's, let's not look at that. Acria says, oh yeah, I think Aishamins don't like you because they want Aisha for themselves. Musa short, she can't even suck his dick. That was not an image I wanted to see in my mind. Now I'm going to go get arrested. Thanks, Brandcliff. <laughs> Jiggle Physics says, is I a better husband though than Ad? I don't know, ask somebody who likes either of those people. Kaiser Crow says, Got random parties frame rates to absolute shit with Bloom if you ever keep EE plus. Oh yeah, I guess I could use my Ein to kill people's frame rates, but that's what I have my Reyna and my Optimus for. Uh, Nekolu says, Also, who is the best husbando that isn't Chung, might I ask? I don't know, ask someone who likes husbandos. Uh, Aiden says Blue Hen is a lesbian. Wouter says KOG's team hits blood. Yo, what if me, like, guys with tits? KOG boss. Bruh. New character. Acria says Elsword Economics 101 with Brancliff featuring Wouter and Acria. You know what? Maybe I should have random cameos on my videos. Maybe I should have it be like. <laughs> I could have that be a Patreon thing. Pay $1 and you can be the next person to say B -b 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 Brancliff. <laughs> Oh god. Oh god, y'all are weird. I don't really know a lot about my fan base that I can say something about. Like, oh, my fan base is mostly into this, but I do want to know about that, so I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna do one of those, like, poll things on the top right of the video with the I button that you click on the thing and it opens up a poll. Um, okay. To all the Brandcliff fans specifically, um, uh, boobs or no boobs, go. Bam. Okay, I put the thing on the top right. Click on the thing, make a vote, and I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll show the polls for that on another video where I'll inevitably probably be disappointed with all of you. Oh yeah, and uh, Elsword the anime uh, episode two review recorded 
Um, need to start editing that. It's basically the next project after Elrian talk. Where's the either vote or neither? Oh, yeah, I mean, okay, I, I, I guess I'll have a middle of the ground option for like normal sized boobs, I guess. Let's see, Sprua says Acura Gay. Wow, alright, jeez. Uh, Wouter says, say this. Uh. Ooh, no, I don't think I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Let's pass on that. Uh, Acrius says to Spiro and know you. Okay, I, I, I think uh, I think when we get to a point where my DMs are being used to talk to other people in other parts of the DM, uh, that's where I leave this video. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Stick around for the Breakliff channel. Uh, I, I'm like a politician. I'm going to make 90 promises and then fulfill two of them. So uh, make America great again. I'm Breakliff. Goodbye, everyone.